Hi, in this tutorial we are going to solve a question related to naming of conjugated molecules. The question asks us to name the given molecule according to IUPAC uh, guidelines. In order to solve this question, we have to uh, look at the double bonds, uh, alkene functionalities. So the rule says that we have to start from the end nearer to first double bond, which is uh, here and we have to find the longest chain. If we start numbering from this end, let's say number 1, number 2, number 3, 4, 5, we have to go this way to find the longest chain and 7. So this is a 7 carbon uh, long uh, chain and it's going to be heptane based when we are naming hepta 7. Okay, and we have to uh, look at the location of double bonds, alkene functionality. So we have an alkene functionality at the second carbon and at the four. So we have to basically specify the locations of double bonds. And we have two branch points, two substituents here at five. That's right here, methyl. And at six, we have methyl. So basically, we will have a 5,6-dimethyl heptene, but since we have two double bond, heptadiene. But uh, when you have alkenes, double-double uh, bond, carbon-carbon uh, double bond functionality, we have to always check whether it is cis-trans or easy. And generally, uh, when we are looking at alkenes, uh, uh, like substituents more than uh, or alkene functionality with more than three two substituents we generally uh, prefer easy designation and for the two uh, alkene I will I will follow easy guideline okay when we look at uh, this uh, double bond uh, you are we, uh, the uh, methyl and the other alkyl functionality they are at the opposite uh, sides so this is going to be E so let's start in the parenthesis we have to look tell where is the location of double bond 2 and whether it is E or Z so since it's an on the opposite end when we split this double bond into two so carbon and carbon they are facing opposite ends so it has to be E 2E and if you have more than uh, one double bond, one alkene functionality, you have to specify the other alkene uh, group as E or Z. So let's look at here. If we uh, chop this double bond, let's use the, uh, another color. If you chop this double bond into two halves, so there is a hydrogen here, and uh, hydrogen versus carbon, so this has high priority, so let's say higher. And here on this carbon we have a methyl and a CH3, a carbon with two methyl groups. Basically this part has higher priority. Again let's write higher. So higher priorities are on the same face of the double bond. So it's going to be uh, it's going to be Z. So let's say uh, let's use the same color. So the location of double bond is 4 so this has to be 4 and we have to say Z we have to close the parenthesis and after that we have to place a dash and we have to tell the location of uh, substituents basically 5 and 6 dimethyl so 5 comma 6 dash we have to start with capital letter dimethyl this is heptane with seven carbon and uh, I will follow the newer naming guidelines so we have to say dimethyl hepta this is a diene we have to say hepta and we have to tell the location of double bonds at number two and number four hepta Two four dash 
I don't have space here I will follow I will continue from here day in so this is uh, this is the answer for this question thank you so much for watching